Nice. Double Dragon Advance on the Nintendo Game Boy Advance, released in 2004 by Atlas, but based on the arcade machine of the same name, released in 1987 by Technos, but distributed around the world by Taito. Pretty sure we're all familiar with Double Dragon. It's kind of a spiritual successor to Renegade, and it's kind of established with sort of creating the modern side-scrolling beta. I love that, by the way. That dude back there is packing hardware. Why don't you just wave that in the air? Why did you have to punch her in the gut? Right. Also, when you just get in your bloody car and tear all the way downtown, bypassing all these thugs? I don't know, that's just me. But, you know. Right, so this is kind of an update. Um, they've updated the graphics. I, I am liking the fact that, you know, it, it's... What's that? It's English tear. English tear. And, hey, if you want an English tear, now you know where to shop. Right, yeah, they, they have kind of, oh nice, face, meet, knee. They've kind of updated it, I do really like that. Very reminiscent of the arcade, although I don't like the fact that my character kind of, oh, look at that sexy uppercut. He's lost his little emo eye makeup, right, hang on. That's odd, shoulder buttons, I've got a block. Hang on, right, oh shit. Right, right, I've got a jump. Oh, oh, I don't like what you've done to my kick. It looks more like the performing arts than it does martial arts. And, and that kick was low. Oh, I've got an idea. Oh, I've got a dash. Oh, you've got a whole heap of new moves. There's Mickey Mouse's hand. Anyway, so the story is uh, you can play as Billy or Jimmy Lee. They're twins, and the Black Shadow Gang nick their bird. Uh, so you go to get it back. Absolute groundbreaking game, you know. I, when did Vigilante come out? Because that was in 1987 as well. well. Look at you with your Bruce Lee moves. But yeah, you know, weapons along the way, boss fights. And I, I love it. It always reminds me of that arcade I first experienced it in, in Westwood Ho, where it was right next to the entrance to the chippy. So whenever I smell chips, I always think of Double Dragon. And that's no bad thing, right? I do like the fact that it's got Volkswagen beaten because one Volkswagen kind of like absolute, you know, Nazi about police. Oh look at that! Oh look at that! Policing the you know the rights or the image of the beat, or possibly a bit off a little bit more than I could chew here. Oh, that's balls! Right, flying kick, Dave is the future. There we go. Just get rid of spandex, boy. And then, I love the fact that everyone in this town is a badass martial artist. Anyway, I lost my thread. Something I really wanted to say, and I've always wanted to say, spoilers, for the end, is once you get to the end, and you can totally use the bloke's machine gun at the end, which is wicked cool, um, you have to fight your brother, if you're in two-player mode, to see who wins the bird. Well, here's my problem with that. Stay still, wrestle boy. What, what's the deal with that? It, it, whose bird is she? Is she, I mean, like, is she undecided? Is she just leading you on? I mean, clearly she's playing at both the home and away end of the stadium. And that's just not cricket. Well, there is a nice mechanic to the gameplay that you get to fight each other at the end. Right, die, you fucking spandex prick. Nice. Uh, my One of my strongest memories of this is I had it on my master system back in the day and we went to a town down the road, you know, on my birthday, um, Western Supermare, we had fish and chips, again another strong sort of reason I associate fish and chips with Double Dragon, is that wrong, I associate fish and chips with Double Dragon, and um, yeah, bought it for my birthday, came home, played it with my brother, and loved it, that's a really, really strong port as well, it's been, all oh, of this bag puss up there, it's been ported, yeah, knifey knifey, to everything, uh, NES, Master System, oh shit, it's like Bowler Young, Double Impact, if you don't know what Double Impact is, I'm sure my age, Key to fights like this is don't scroll too far forward. But yeah, played it with my brother, absolutely loved it. But yeah, it's on the Amiga, the Atari ST, the Atari 2600, the 7800, you name it, there's a version of it. Spectrum, which is a pants version, but you know, absolutely amazing game. Never a fan of any of the sequels. They could be brilliant, I just, oh, fuck you. Him, not you. Never got on board with them, wow. Right. 
or I wanted to really punch you in the face. Wow. Oh, I can chin them. That's nice. Yeah, I never got on board with any sequels, particularly the third one was that the Rosetta Stone. I just thought that was a bucket full of fucking monkey bollocks. I know, I'm being incredibly cheap with the movies. I do like the way, as I said, they've updated the graphics and the move roster. It's definitely, you know, when you do these old classic games, show homage to the original game, but there's nothing wrong with bringing something a little bit new to the party. I am liking this. Oh shit, until that happened. And he brought all his mates in because he's too much of a pussy to fight me by himself. I wonder if it's... Oh! I got some new moves. Oh! And I can... Wow. Can I pick... I can pick that up, can't I? Yeah, I'm really, really liking this. You know, like, pay homage to, you know, the games that those of us grew up with absolutely love. But when you do stuff like this, this is a brilliant example of how you update it. And apparently I can chin people while they're standing behind me. Well, I am a martial art bastard. That's kind of cool. I really do like that. I, also, why are you pointing forwards but looking the other direction? What do I know? I'm not a martial art beast. Right. I've got to do a gameplay of the, the actual original Game Boy version as well, because I had that back in the day, and I remember that being pretty strong ports. There's holes in the floor, isn't there? And if you play it right, you can kick them off them. Oh, shit. Look at you packing explosives. Come down. No, no. No. This is how I used to do the Master System and the arcade. I used to be really cheap and just, just knock them off the edge. But it's a double-edged sword because it probably kicks you in the balls as well. Look, I mean, I know I can't complain because I'm also wearing double denim, but look at you with your stonewashed double denim. Where exactly are you hiding this shit? Alright. Ooh, I've got a block. That's new. Let's te check out my block, or test my block, I should say. Wow, well, really, are you that comfortable to wear pink? Well, it's the 80, I'll let you off, right? Come on. I'm blocking. Oh, so it's only semi-effective. Everyone's packing fucking dynam dynamite. Oh, no, you should have blown up. Right. Well, that was pointless. Oh, look at me with my fly fucking Jackie Chan moves. Mickey Mouse hand again. I'm not liking the fact that jumps on the shoulder button. That's not working for me. How do I do the low kick? Right, I got it. I do like that, right? Let's try a combo. Come up here. Right, here we go. I don't know how you do it. But thanks for the retching noise. Yeah, I'm not liking the fact that jumps on the... Right, I have you. Uh, on the shoulder bone. Batter up. Oh, fuck. It's a bit claustrophobic. Bollocks. Oh, that was a nice noise. No, right, come on. If I stay here, oh, I can do absolutely fuck all. Right, resort to the cheap. Kick. Kick. Oh, run away from dynamite. There you go. There's a public infomercial, you know, sponsored by the government. Hey, children, whenever you see dynamite on the street, remember. Oh, fuck. Run away. It is quite impressive how many... Boom! Out of the park, people are on the screen at once. Right, let's go for a homer. Boom! Oh yeah. Right, I'm gonna call it quits in a minute, because I don't want this to be massively long. Right, but there we go. Oh shit! Oh no! Oh no! Right, yeah, cheap. Ooh, I could have fallen down. My god, it's like a ballet. Look at it. It's not it's not so much martial arts, but more performing arts. I would have kicked him in the plums. Although, judging by how tight his lycra shorts are, I don't think he's sporting a pair. Oh, you can knock him through this, can you? It's like the self-scan at a supermarket. I.e. Everyone hates it. Come on. No, yeah, see? Oh, fuck. Oh, agents. It's just gone Matrix. Should I? Oh, should I? Ah! Yeah, I guess you didn't get upgrades. Music's brilliant as well. 
Yeah. How do you like them apples, Agent Smith? Oh, there's more of you. Ooh, I like, I did like that noise. Oh, two for, that worked. So that's a con me. Right, get out the whips. Oh, see you later. More agents. I always found the whip very in... Oh! I really should have read the instructions, shouldn't I? I always find the whip really ineffectual on every version. Oh my god, look at them. If someone dope test them, we'll check your dice. Clearly they are nicked from the Matrix, aren't they? Right. A worth the sacrifice, I think. Oh! Now Morpheus is in the party. Right, I'm just going to finish these guys. And then come up here, Morpheus. Up here. No, no, no. Yeah, that works. No, no, no. Over here, over here, over here. Self-scan. Ten items or less. Come on. Oh, fuck. Ah, bollocks. Gonna call it quits there. Double Dragon on the Game Boy Advance. Uh, I'm actually quite pleasantly surprised with how good a port this is. Anyway, thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you later.